Today I'm gonna be showing you. Okay, hey guys, Shadow Mist here. I'm gonna be showing you a cool little video. It's gonna it's Team Fortress 2 related, Steam related. Now what you're gonna need is you're gonna need a few things. You're gonna need a, a you're gonna this is on Max. Gonna how to install skins 2015 on Max. So. I'm gonna take a festive weapons thing, 2011 festive weapons. Turns all your stock weapons into your into festive ones. So let's get right to the point. So obviously you're gonna need TF2, and you're gonna have to download the skin. I use Google Chrome, um, and an Explorer is uh, too too great, too perfect. Um, you click on the download button, you download it. Go to local copy. I recommend that. And go to Finder. Don't mind this. Don't mind this. So go to Finder. Go to. Pretty sure it is. Go up here. It's gonna say Go. Click Alt on your keyboard. It's gonna mm, library is gonna pop up. Click on Library. Click on Application Support. Steam. Steam Apps. Common. Team Fortress Two. Don't mind these. These are just some of my sprays and stuff. So go to TF, custom, and if you don't have a custom folder, make one. And if you're using, pretty sure it's 34-bit uh, or something like that. If you're using a different thing, it's going to say, it's a completely different thing. It's going to say your username here and stuff, so I recommend another video. And you're going to go to custom, and all these skins will not be here. These are just my skins. And uh, if you guys want to know how to get HUDs, I'll teach you in another video. I'm using Eve HUD right now. So go to. You, there's not gonna be no my custom stuff here. That's a heads up. You have to make a new folder. And let me explain this. So you make a my custom stuff folder. You open it up. Then it's not gonna be here. And let's say you wanna get. You have. You download a skin and it says materials and model. You're probably like, what am I gonna do with that? So what you're gonna do is make a folder called my custom stuff. And then you're gonna drag the materials and models into here. And when you load up the game, it should work perfectly fine. Last time I checked. And if you're using VPKs, as seen right here, Spy Taunts Pack VPK for the Spy Shuffle. Now I already have it placed in here. Um, I have a few other skins. CSGO knife. Um, if I could find it in here. Uh, <coughs> excuse, I have a little bit of a cold. Also, I'm gonna teach you how to. Download an Australian skin pack later on. The feature, if you guys want any more of these things, I'll be happy to make more. I'm trying to find it. Uh, mm, where is it? Jeez. I'm so sorry it's taking so long. Uh, it should be in here somewhere. I think I already placed it in here. Okay, it's not in here, so I guess I'm going to have to place it again. I'm mm, going to go to... Uh, just going to go... Let's just, let's just download it again. Click on this. And it should load. Whatever. I'm going to go to... Three. Wait, no. Uh, downloads. So festive, I'm living raw. This is gonna have a VBK in there. I'm gonna go to copy, and over here, go to your custom stuff, paste it in there. Replace, yeah, it's somewhere in there. Um, and there you go. That is pretty much how you get skins. Now I'm gonna load up Team Fortress 2, and I hope this works. Then I'm probably gonna push publish it. But if it doesn't work, then I'm probably it's gonna go in the trash can. <laughs> And also, if you're wondering what thing I'm using to record, I'm using QuickTime Player. It's okay. It's better than my Google Plus live stream recorder. That's just, like, scary. Um, my TF2 takes a long time since I have, like, a bunch of skins and a bunch of dot catch stuff on my thing. I have to, like, remove that soon. So, it should work. But the one problem is with this festive pack, if you want to download it, I'll put a link in the description. When you go on the blue team, you'll still have the red vest of light, which is the problem that I have, too. Everyone's going to have the problem, unless someone makes a fixed pack, which I'm really hoping someone does. 
because when I make skins, for some reason they never work using GS GCF Scape and VTF Ed. I'm just not good for skin making, and my voice is really squeaky on YouTube for some reason. But in real life, it's not. Trust me, it's not as squeaky. You can hear so much clicking in the background with the screen recorder. That's why I hate it. And I can hear my own voice when I'm recording it, which is really annoying. It gets me confused. When I first had this, I thought, like, it was so confused with it, but now I know how to use it a little bit. I'm so sorry it's taking so long. Chill it out. Uh, okay, go to my skull loadout. Go to Scattergun. And, yeah, you see the festival lights. Woo! 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 Yeah. Okay. You can even have, like, festive bot killers, too, and if... I think if you get the... Man, that actually looks really nice. So you can get the, um... This in the description. And I'm gonna teach you how to get the Australian pack next. Oh, I forgot. They didn't make it for that yet. Pretty sure they made it for Sticky Bomb. What did they make for demo? I don't even know. I don't know. What? I don't know. It doesn't work for heavy. I guess some of them don't work. So, I'll tell you which ones don't work. Does the wrench work? Please tell me the wrench works. The wrench is like best. Okay, you got the wrench. Um, sniper rifle's working. Sniper rifle's working. Um, uh, medic, you should have the medigun. Yup. Um, spy should have the knife. I. No, I already have a skin for it. That's why it's not working. I have a CSGO butterfly knife. But I just really wanted the scout thing. thing. This one. If you want the backpack icons, I recommend different skin. Which I will link in the description too. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you want to see more, just comment down below. If you have any problems, I'll be glad to reply to them. And I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.